IPR, ISP's well-known student-run national social venture competition, serves as a platform for dynamic entrepreneurs and working professionals to turn their social enterprise ideas into reality and hence make a difference in the society that we're all a part of. Today, we're all gathered here to kickstart the fifth idea, a journey that will take us and our partners through the application phase, evaluation phase, bootcamp phase, and then mentoring beyond the bootcamp. I request our chief guest, Mr. M. N. Rao, Chairman of MET RCH EduTech Limited and MET Skills Link Learning in Hyderabad, Sharpaji, Director of Student Activities, Sunil Albal, our President of the Graduate Student Board, and Shavan Gajula, the lead coordinator, to join us on stage. I'd like to learn. I extend a warm welcome to all our guests from the industry, IKEA families, allies, directors, professors, members of the ISB community, members of the media, and my dear colleagues. Today marks the beginning of a year-long effort by the students of the BGD class of 2014 to enable and support ideas and enterprises that create a positive social impact. Over the last four years, IDEA has seen around 250 participants. Any Indian working professional who is passionate about creating a social change through sustainable business enterprises can participate in IDEA. Is IDEA just a business plan competition? No. With the assured guidance of industry experts, funding opportunities for potential investors, IDEA is much more than that. This competition is completely unique. I haven't heard of anything like this uh, in, my, in my 29 years of working experience. So I must compliment ISP for having conceptualized something like this. It's not only a competition, but it is designed it again and again. It's, it's a well beyond that. So this is a, this is a, a long uh, and a, a hand-holding process, as I see that would eventually lead to uh, a fluorescence of new enterprises uh, and, and to see a young generation getting sensitized to those possibilities is very hard to Isan School actually is a platform that provides information to the farmers on a real-time basis using mobile technology. So we provide this information through text, voice as well as P2P. We know that the product will be there and it can be given and it can be you know, marketed and the cost and benefit ratio and all these things, economics, everything. But we never had a proper approach to design or build a business plan. So that was the greatest thing that we learned during our boot camp. With our small price money, we went back and we started a venture and just after six months, we registered our first 10 customers. That was a breakthrough. Next we have Mr. T.J. David. He is a well-known inventor and research fellow and currently a research faculty at IIIT Hyderabad. His idea, a low-cost solar-powered harvester, a venture which provides a very low-cost fuel-efficient harvesting technology that improves economic and social conditions of farmers in India. ISP made me proud. That's why I am very pleased. Now, I am happy after this event when I attended you. I have got worth 10 crore rupees offer to start up this uh, from the world. Mobile Science Lab is a 40 seater school bus which has been converted into a science lab. And we go to different schools, perform the experimental methods, and train the student in developing thinking minds. Last two years, I think they have traveled around 25,000 kilometers covering Haryana, Uttar Pradesh, West Bengal, uh, Kerala, and Karnataka. Benefited 21,000 students to explain them what is the importance of hands on learning and what is the importance of scientific methodology and scientific methods. 